what's up everybody it's your girl bianca back with another video okay so i heard um someone like not in a negative way but like someone's keeping tabs on you or they're trying to see what you're up to I feel like somebody wants to collaborate with you somebody definitely wants to speak something i feel like they want to relax with you see go take a leap of faith and then be patient for me maybe this person is slow moving like slow moving not you know slow slow but maybe they just move very slowly they don't rush into anything maybe they didn't want a connection or their relationship to be like codependent so it's like you know, when it's like somebody constantly in your energy and you're just like, oh my God, like they don't want it to get like that in a sense. They want it to be a healthy and not like somebody's always around you because you could always be around your person, but it's kind of like to feel like they need that person. You, you have to be whole, you know, by yourself and be confident, happy by yourself. And then, you know, you can get into a connection or i guess you can say a healthy connection where you know you guys are having even you know energy flow in between the connection and it's not just like one person giving or one person taking stuff like that look friendship having a friendship no deceit no deception because it did come in the reverse this is like cloudy days or someone being all like depressed or like and then it says friendship so you see maybe having a friendship with your person or with somebody first is how you feel like a connection should flow see let it go let it flow let it go let it flow so maybe you are just letting things go maybe someone's seeing that there's nothing you don't hide anything there's no deception about you that you're genuine friend because maybe somebody is feeling like somebody could have said something and now this person's just looking at them like really dude like and then it's like please forgive me maybe somebody maybe somebody maybe lied or said something there was some sort of deception but it's like you don't hide anything this was like you had genuine friendship or it was nothing it was nothing deceitful and it's like maybe somebody wants to because i was getting when someone looking at somebody like that it's like like somebody could have said something to your person about you and like now and this person's not looking at them like they're not even listening they're they're like saying sorry or something it's like no like bro you know what you said something in order to create some sort of divide like it's it's obvious, like, you know, so this person's not even paying attention to that other person anymore. They're blocking the, the, uh, that other person. See, they charge you, sending negative energy, blocked. Somebody was blocked. Somebody wants your forgiveness or they're asking for some sort of forgiveness. Don't give up on us. Okay, so maybe um, somebody's pleading. Somebody is going to be pleading to you, like, they don't want to end this friendship or they don't want to end this partnership. I regret not giving us a chance. I want to have another chance to prove my love to you or my love for you. And then you're in recovery mode. So maybe this person had to, maybe they put you in a depressive state or they like made you feel like you had to heal. Yeah, because I was getting like wilted flower. See, lesson learned. This person, this was a lesson for them. The person that lied or the person that said something and the person that was deceptive. Intimacy, maybe about some sort of intimacy. <laughs> your focus, it says focus on your life purpose. And somebody could have lied. This was, this, was, this was definite deception. This could have been a friend. Intimacy, this is a lesson learned. Don't give up on us. Maybe somebody is seeing that like, you're focused, you deserve love, maybe that you um, respect yourself, yeah, that you're all about, you know, getting to, you know, the bag, your money, like, you're very, you know, successful, you're patient, you take time to rest, to heal yourself, you could be in hermit mode, but yeah, there could have been, somebody could be wanting to get close to you, or maybe there's somebody telling Somebody like, don't, don't give up. Like maybe they're trying to get close to you or something like this. Or they're trying to, yeah, like feel more 
like connected to you or something. Maybe somebody regrets not giving you like a fair chance or something. They misjudged you or they they had some sort of perception about you. I won't hurt you again in freedom. So maybe something this person has been taught some sort of lesson um, or there's some sort of maybe somebody is re like they're um, freeing you from some sort of cycle or like something that's like see obstacles are detours in the right direction some sort of obstacle yeah maybe you had to maybe there were just a lot of like twists and turns that's what i'm getting like somebody made you go through something over and 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 over <laughs> anxiety is in the reverse you no longer have anxiety maybe somebody's releasing you from some sort of like like let's just say somebody lied okay this person's telling the truth now like okay this is what really happened like you're being released from this like see let go you're being i'm in, i'm in my ego maybe you, that this person was in their ego in the past they're letting go of this perception this lie whatever this whatever it is yours your this blessing this you know they're del whatever they were delaying because it's not something that like let's say someone because i want to say took something from you they tried to you know take something that was yours and when i say those words think of energetically wise not like literally physically could be physically taking something but just you know creating some sort of energy or manipulation in people that they didn't choose you or they didn't go your way or they didn't you know hire you or they didn't choose you to you know have that promotion or have that, you know, title or have that relationship or whatever it can be, that friendship or that spot in that, you know, in that, I don't know, in that team, on that team or on that, in that club, I don't know. I'm thinking about high school, but it's kind of like they didn't give you a fair chance or they didn't give you, see, but is lingering, focus on your life purpose. Somebody was trying to create, somebody was definitely in their ego. They were trying to create some sort of anxiety. They have to now let go of this. You could be maybe, maybe you knew, you had an idea, you had an inkling, a niggling feeling about what the heck was going on. Sometimes I lay awake at night and wonder what you're doing and if you feel the same about me, I can't get you off from my mind. So somebody maybe wanted to, you not to be around. Um, and so let's just say somebody it's like when someone says no or restricts you from doing something somebody can get angry or whatever but also um when you can't do something or when you can't obtain something it makes you want it more i guess you can say so it's kind of like you got to think about is this ego or is this true genuine connection so maybe this person is now seeing that this is actual connection or this is you know, it's not just for their benefit or your benefit type of thing. They didn't want some sort of like codependency in a sense of like a karmic connection. See, like something that was that they were going to have to learn more lessons. A wish is coming true. They see that you because I'm getting like, oh, I'm also getting maybe somebody was like looking through something or like they were like spring cleaning or like cleaning up. And they found something that was like maybe your handwriting or something that was yours or that was left like. You know, maybe they saw something that like maybe you gave them or maybe they had to, I don't know, because I'm getting a scenario in a sense where somebody was like looking through stuff and like, you know, organizing and then they found like a book and it's like your book or they found like something that had your handwriting or something and then they're like feeling nostalgic or they're like, what the heck? Like, what was I thinking? All your dreams are coming true. You time. Yeah. New love. Somebody is definitely wanting to come your way. Yeah, clear your energy. What is for you will never pass you by. I feel like this person is like racing to you. I regret, not, I regret not telling you how I truly feel. You will create a family together. I misjudged you. See, <laughs> somebody definitely is feeling choked up about this. This new love. This person wants to come in. I can't imagine my life without you. I actually funny thing i never do this well not like never but i have a bunch of my cards here in like little boxes but i have some put away and i actually was drawn to grab some tarot cards and oracle cards and even these that i didn't these ones that i just used i was drawn to grab them to use in this reading so yeah so we have some oracle cards 
here we have two so this one i don't remember the name of it but they're affirmation cards and they they're like um dang it i forgot the name i have like three decks they're all the same um the same back it's just different colors so one is like blue one is pink and this one's gold ah what is it called one is called like the spirit junkie maybe this is the spirit junkie so maybe you're very much into spirituality i forgot what the other ones are called but it was like yeah but they're affirmation cards the universe works fast when i'm having fun so maybe you are feeling more lighthearted something to do with because i like these watercolors maybe you show a lot of emotions maybe you're just you know having fun maybe this is going to be a time somebody wants to have fun with you they want to paint the rainbow this is what i heard paint the rainbow back in your life um also something to do with having children or they maybe they see you being like a mother or they see that you're in alignment and becoming like that wife mother person like maybe this is you're at the age of course but the moment i realign with love clear direction is presented to me maybe this person had to have more fun or they had to redirect their energy into just like thinking through the lens of love that's what it is they're looking through the eyes of love not the eyes of hate or the eyes of envy they had to they're trying to be happy for the people around them maybe this person was being kind of envious or this person is seeing their where they lacked in this connection in the past when i accept the love of the universe as my primary teacher i will always be guided back to the light yeah so um realizing that there are the, all the lessons we learn everything that we experience the delays we go through each tower moment meaning anything that's you know abrupt that changes or things that we didn't know and that shock us that creates a tower so that things change our relationship ends suddenly uh you know a job and suddenly um something and suddenly or just in general something begins suddenly you get a new job and it's like the job of your dreams or you meet the person that you you know align with and that is the same energy as you and you're attracted to this person and you have great chemistry and great um goals and great you know a moral compass you guys align in that sense and that's how you know that what is in front of you is real if you i'm getting like something about eyes and then like when this person it's like when they're face to face with you or something like this or when they're like looking at you they can they see they're you're connected definitely that was confirmation you guys i don't know if you guys heard it but it was like the little er, the little machine thing that air air freshener or whatever okay see the eyes it says, um, when I lean on certainty and faith, I change my mind about the world I see. So yeah, maybe somebody is changing their perception. They're trying to visualize something different, not destruction. They're trying to visualize rainbows and getting back into that like childlike energy of like letting whatever from the past like created traumas or the projection of people telling you that you're this, you're that, you should be this, you should be that. Just letting go of that and not caring because at the end of the day yes your family means everything but your person that your your significant other they're gonna be there for you they're that person that supports you they're gonna take care of you they're gonna nurture you like when you're sick you know this is your person your children yes but what i'm trying to say is you're finding that person that's gonna be there to pick you up when you're down to give you peace when others are giving you chaos this is somebody that you know has peace within and you're bringing peace to them and it's kind of like you guys are fluctuating like in a good like energy flow um i wanted to read i don't i didn't think i read i wanted to read it where'd it go i like was <laughs> opening and closing the deck so did i put it down it's like the capacity where'd it go Ugh. Because I looked at the card when I first opened the deck. So I was like, oh, I want to read it. I'm going to read it. I'm going to find it. I'm getting the song. Am I wrong? 
But thinking that we could be something for real. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, am I wrong? Where is it? I swear, did I put it down somewhere? Ay, ay, ay. It's, oh, it's right here. <laughs> and that's by, um, it's called Am I Wrong by Nico something. The energy, I mean, the, my capacity to tune into the energy of love gives me the words I need when I'm ready to speak up, the compassion I need when it's time to forgive, and the power I need when I am lost. So somebody may be wanting to speak some sort of energy of love towards you. They want to, maybe this person felt like they were lost in the dark. Maybe you charged them up. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe they feel connected to you. One more oracle card. Yeah, let's see. So your finances could be looking up or maybe I'm getting like star star light or a star bright. Maybe you're you shine very bright. You could be removing things, see clearing your energy, maybe when it comes to your money, your money mindset. A windfall of abundance. Maybe you're going to be receiving some sort of blessings that's going to be allow you to save money. Maybe you're just visualizing success in a different way. You definitely catch somebody's eye or you caught someone's eye. The power of prayer. So give the situation to God for uplifting and healing and be open to miracles. Heaven's unlimited resources, love, and answers are awaiting your prayers. Be sure to act upon the divine guidance God gives you in response to your prayers. So, you got power of prayer. At the bottom of the deck, we have pay yourself first. So, do things for you first and then other people, okay? Make sure everything's good for you and then you can help others. Make yourself your more oh, la, 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 la. make yourself your most important financial obligation by setting aside a portion of your income income every time you are paid. This loving form of self care ensures that you'll have savings to invest in your present and your future. Yeah, so maybe you're gonna be able to save. Maybe you are starting to save, you know, your energy, save your money, save your time from the people, places, things that created a lot of chaos, destruction, or that took all your time and. You got nothing in return. It's like, come on. Okay, so we're going to do quick little tarot and get out of here. It's actually pretty cold. Somebody was not wanting to see a situation. Maybe they were, there was a lot of options of that. There were a lot of um, illusions about something, about somebody energy or something like this their spirituality religion tradition maybe marriage or something like this or some sort of connection yeah seven of swords somebody was manipulating a situation there was some sort of secret or some sort of deception when it came to a divine feminine an empress somebody that somebody was manipulating a situation yeah they wanted something to end Yep, but the truth is being revealed. This person could have said the truth or there's something that this person figured out. Like, let's just say the person, this person. Okay, let's say there's two people. There's friendship situation. You're dating somebody, the friend or whatever. They said something. They thought, and it's funny because I'm getting like, this person was so like adamant about something or they lied in the past and this like, maybe they came back again, and it's like, no, dude, this is not true. Like, now I know for a fact you're lying, because I know this to be true, or da 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 Yeah, somebody could be feeling like there was some sort of confrontation, or somebody confronted somebody. Maybe they felt like somebody was aggressive. Somebody's going to be needing to find their strength, I guess what you can say, because now this person's feeling sad that the truth is out. Um, this person was definitely in their ego, uh maybe they didn't have some sort of they were trying to like assert their dominance or something like this they were in some sort of imbalance yeah maybe some sort of depression maybe somebody took back their love like let's just say somebody like deceived somebody because i'm getting like somebody deceived somebody to think somebody was like a bad person and then um 
this person realize like no this person is not a bad person like i've watched them i've seen you know how they are I've, I've been around them long enough to understand that this person is a good person this person is a sweetheart so eventually this this clarity this truth was going to come out this person is sad maybe they whatever it is that they got out of this like let's say it was a relationship somebody chose them over you something they um they took their love back they took their cup of love back so this person is now nine of swords in their head having anxiety because somebody released them yep and somebody feels like yep ghosts are also there could be some sort of bad luck some reversal see breakup somebody feels rejected they're struggling now they're in denial about something you definitely somebody is definitely defending you or you defended yourself or you stood in your power maybe you have a lot of strength you could be somebody who's very much like um you could be very different too um also somebody could have been because i'm getting like let's say somebody wanted to be like you or somebody wanted to seem like this nine of discs this knight of pentacles meaning they, this person was stable you know independent but and stable this person is not there's nine of pentacles this person they they're greedy they could be you know very um insecure about their i was gonna say about their body or about something but there's they have low confidence yeah they could be they could feel maybe like not powerful or there's like they're always like because I, I heard rigid but also coming up against like I don't know maybe they feel like they had to i don't know they're all up in their head there's definitely some sort of maybe because there's a spiritual connection within a relationship or between two people this person can't like compete with that that's what they're get. that's what i'm getting somebody wants to give equally they want to give you some sort of opportunity or they see that you are like the window to new opportunities you're the breakthrough yeah you are very desirable somebody also loves your creativity they could see that you are very much the idealistic person they're very romantic yeah they feel like maybe um they want you could have maybe because i'm getting you healed right somebody wanted to create some sort of loss for you but uh maybe somebody didn't want to work with you work together with you somebody could have been all up in their head maybe they were feeling a little stuck hopeless about something eight of pentacles something to do with work i'm getting somebody could have and i just saw theft so it's like there could have been all false friends as well could have taken something yeah maybe you struggled there was some sort of lack of like like energy like somebody wasn't making the effort or something okay let's see whoa okay so somebody wanted to take something also when it comes to like what was what made you stable like your home they wanted the protection of your home to be like they didn't want you to feel protected or like you had you like control or something yeah and then the devil energy this person was is all up in their mind like constantly thinking about something constantly like in their head maybe they feel like they that maybe they were obsessing over some sort of connection see some sort of partnership maybe because somebody is healing some sort of partnership somebody feels bored now with this or they're disconnected with this situation and they can't like they don't know what's going on they like nobody i'm getting like nobody's telling them or like yeah somebody could have been they could have seen this person like whoever lied let's just say this person oh when i'm getting lie pregnancy hard work somebody dedicated somebody was waiting on like some sort of truth maybe this person wanted was doing it out of greed or something they wanted money or Somebody could be angry about this. This could have been in the past. Somebody's going to feel stuck. They don't want somebody to like, they don't want somebody to find this out or like to see how sneaky they were. This person was definitely in their ego. Ace of Wands. They didn't want, <laughs> they didn't want somebody to get this Ace of Cups, this loving offer. Yeah. Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. This person is like, 
depressed. They're like, they have to accept that this is done. See, this person's in the bath and they're like, you know, crying. Yeah, because this person's not independent. This person, yeah, there is some sort of ending. Yep, this King of Cups has now, like, I'm getting like, they rejected this offer. Like, they've re, they've got, they got it back. Like, they... You know, it's like rescinded or something. Rescinded the offer. It's like they, like let's just say you obtain something and it's like, nope. Well, you got to give it all back now. Sorry, it was a mistake. It wasn't, you weren't supposed to get that. You, you falsified this. This wasn't you. See the magician in the reverse? Yeah. The empress, <laughs> the magician, this is um some sort of manipulation. Somebody was trying to manipulate some sort of, uh, for some sort of abundance in some sort of partnership but you see clearly the moon you could be very wise you could have big eyes too i'm just gonna grab a couple from this from this deck let's do three okay so someone can no longer move forward with a situation they don't have they don't have the power anymore they see that you have the power um you could be something could be coming very quickly maybe somebody's watching you they've made a discovery they're no longer moving forward with they they see that you're very disciplined they don't want to move forward in any like whatever from the past let's say somebody um changed some sort of they were trying to change some sort of fate yeah this person's all up in their head this person <laughs> they see that you're very disciplined you're determined you let a chariot you move forward yeah, somebody's definitely wanting to come your way very quickly. Maybe they want to travel towards you. They could be watching you to see, maybe see what you're up to, see what you're doing. Out of wands, they see that you've persevered through a lot. Yeah. Maybe you had to heal from some sort of, like, lack of love or something. People weren't giving you love or nine of cups. This person, they see you as their wish fulfillment. See, gratitude, they're grateful for you. All right, I'm going to get out of here person is no longer in two minds about you they are they're looking at their emotions and they're facing them and they want to come your way and i think they want to explain something to you or they want to i'm getting i got an eye for an eye but also like they want to give you what you've given them and it's like love genuinity friendship um they want partnership with you yep i feel like this person could have walked away from you in the past because the eight of cups is in the reverse Meaning they want to come back. They want, maybe they walked away thinking that they were going to find something better in a sense that they were going thinking they were going to find the sunlight, whatever made them happy. But that was kind of like an illusion. It was that that wasn't happiness, what they thought. So they got got. You thought the sun, see? Vitality and joy. They see you as the sun. They see you as happiness, joy, um, vitality. Anyways, all right, I'll see you guys in my next video. Hopefully everybody has a great weekend. I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye.